This is about clue words in word problems. Every word problem contains clue words as to which operation needs to be performed. I've made a couple of videos like this before, but I thought I'd do this again. When we add, subtract, multiply, divide, or need an unknown variable, there's actually clue words that tell us what to do. If we want to add, we look for words like sum, total, added to, plus, increased by, more than, or greater. And for subtraction, we look for words like difference, minus, less, subtracted from, decreased by, less than, lesser, or fewer. If it wants multiplication, we're going to see words like product, times, multiplied by, of, squared, percent of, percentage of, fraction of, or by. And for division, we're going to see words like quotient, divided by, divided into, or ratio. And then we're going to come across word problems that actually need a variable. And we can use an n, x, or y, or any variable letter to represent what we're trying to solve. If we're solving for dogs, we could use d for dogs. If we're trying to do cars, we could use c for cars. If you see words like by a number, well, that means times that number, n or x or whatever variable you want to choose. By some number means the same thing. By an unknown also means the same thing. It just means times x or n or whatever that variable is that you choose. If it says than a number, like more than or less than, then it's going to be plus n or minus n. For a number less, it's going to be minus n. For a number more, it's going to be plus n or n plus. If it says by a number twice as, then it's going to be 2n. If it's twice as much, it's plus 2n. If it's twice as less, it's minus 2n. And if it's half a number, it's going to be half n. Now, I've made a lot of videos on word problems, like I mentioned. And if you look in this description for a link to my algebra word problem playlist, there's lessons on writing or choosing equations and even solving for word problems. All right? So that should help you. And there's at least a couple of dozen videos in the beginning of that playlist that just talks about turning the words into problems. Even some really difficult algebra ones. All right? I'll see you next time. Bye.